Hi everyone, Assalamu alaikum. Hope you are all doing well. Uh, welcome to my channel. My name is Conan. If you were wondering how to pronounce my name, first of all, Eid Mubarak. Uh, I hope you all had a safe and fun Eid at home. I know this Eid is going to be a different one for all of us. One of my most favorite content to watch on YouTube is uh, these daily vlogs that people do. Uh, more like a day in my life kind of video. So I thought I'll shoot one on Eid. Um, I'm really not doing anything exciting this Eid. I'm just going to stay at home so I'm not really sure what I'll be able to put into this video. I'm sure this is going to be a very short one. Um, but this is my first vlog. I hope you guys enjoy it and also please make sure to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of me and also please do check out my other makeup videos that I have uploaded in the past. I have been planning this video for a week now that I wanted to vlog on Eid and I thought I'll be saying this, I'll be saying that but I'm, I have gone completely blank right now. I don't really know what to say. By the way, this is not my Eid dress. I'll be getting ready later on after I prepare lunch because I usually sweat a lot while cooking or while doing anything for that matter. So I don't want my uh, makeup to ruin as well. I do have uh, a bit of BB cream and lipstick on because I wanted to um, feel up because why not uh, it's about nine o'clock nine nine thirty nine thirty actually uh in the morning so i'll go prepare breakfast for myself and my husband i think i'll prepare oats because it's an easier option i later have a lot of work to do um around the house because i have to prepare for lunch and all that stuff so yeah i think i'll go and prepare breakfast for us After having lunch, I decided to put on my Eid clothes and wear makeup for you guys. I was already super tired and feeling very sleepy but still I wanted to do this for the sake of this video. Uh, I have first applied Smashbox Primer Water and then applied this Face Shop Lip Tint. Now I am applying this Color Bar Primer. This is a pore filling primer and it also mattifies the skin so it is really helpful. Next I am applying this Garnier BB cream on my face instead of a foundation. This BB cream, believe me, I have been using this from more than 10 years now. Earlier people used to use the Fair and Lovely and Fairever creams but I hated that. Uh, I hated how they made my skin look very dry but this cream has a very dewy finish so I have been using this from over 10 years really. So as you can see this gives a nice glow on my face and a very very sheer curve. All the products that I'm using are mentioned on the screen so you can refer that. Here I'm using Makeup Revolution Concealer in the shade C10. I'm going to apply this around my eyes as well as my lips. This is a thick concealer and has good coverage but I'm not going to apply it very heavily. I'm going to then blend out this concealer using a beauty sponge. Thank you. 
Next I am using this Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder in the shade medium to set my under eyes. I am applying the same loose powder over my eyelids as well to set the concealer in place. Next I am using this Wet n Wild Contour Palette. It says contour palette but it has really warm undertone so it works really well as a bronzer. For blush, I am using this one from Freedom Makeup in the shade Lethal Weapon. I am using a Real Techniques brush to apply that. Next I use this Maybelline Master Chrome Highlighter in the shade Molten Gold and applied it on the high points of my face. I directly applied it using my fingertip and then I am just going to blend it out using a beauty sponge. And for my eyebrows, I am using my favorite eyebrow product from Miss Claire. This is a very waxy and smooth pencil. Next for my eyeshadow base, I am using this Lakme Iconic Kajal and I am going to apply a very thick line close to my lash line. And to smudge out the liner, I am going to use this angular brush and soften the Kajal a little bit. Here I am picking up the shade Red Ochre from Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Palette and applying it over the kajal that we have applied earlier. Um, as you can see I am applying very little product to avoid any fallout uh, since I have already done my base so I am just going in picking up product little by little and applying it over my eyelid.
next I'm picking up the shade Cypress Umber from the palette and layer it over the kajal that we have applied. I'm keeping this very close to lash line and I'm not going to take it near the crease of my eye. And for my lower lash line, I am going to first apply the shade Red Ochre and uh, soften it out. Next, I am going to apply the uh, Cypress Umber shade using an angular brush and I am also not applying anything on my waterline. Next I used this mini so eyelash curler and then applied Maybelline Volume Express Mascara on my upper as well as lower lashes. To finish off the look, I used this lip liner from Miss Claire and then applied the Wet n Wild liquid lipstick in the shade Give Me Mocha. Believe me when I say this, I kept this makeup on for 15 minutes max because I was already really sleepy and tired so I decided to take my makeup off because I didn't want to stain my pillows. I also did take off my contact lens and they are from Fresh Look. So there you have it guys, I'm sorry I couldn't film more uh, but I still hope that you guys enjoyed this video. See you next time, bye!